All right, folks, the deck is even Fire's Warrior. In this deck, we've got both Vandar, Stormpike, and Drek'thar because our goal is to draw each of those, play the Fires of Zin Ashari, followed by Vandar, Stormpike, and then a Drek'thar to pull those minions from our deck into play. Aside from that, we're just basically acting as a typical control warrior. We've got a draw engine with Forge of Souls and the tradable weapons, or we can break the weapons with Forged in Flame to draw five cards immediately. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash Watch this! Thank you to Firestone for sponsoring this video. Level up your Hearthstone game with Firestone to track all cards remaining in your deck, as well as your opponent's hand and the graveyard. Keep an eye on every important facet of the game, including damage showing on board, potential secrets in play, and, of course, the number of spells for Yogg. Firestone tracks all of your personal stats and offers a comprehensive meta breakdown. View each of your deck's win rates and monitor your progress on your climb to legend. The binder makes deck building easy by offering in-depth information about the cards and cosmetics in your collection. Curious how many packs you've opened from each set? Firestone has that data for you as well. Earn bragging rights with your friends by completing fun and challenging achievements within Firestone. If BGs is more your thing, the Battlegrounds Companion offers live stats while in a match, your opponent's last known board state, and current battle probability. Firestone also aggregates Battleground statistics to help you learn which heroes or minion types to select and improve as a player. Thanks again to Firestone for sponsoring this video. Download Firestone for free using the link in the video description below. I think I keep the... no. We're just gonna armor other ways because uh, it's often... I could just play this on two. Like if it's Questline Hunter, maybe I wait a little bit, but like I don't really have much of a chance in this matchup anyway. I might as well have some fun. But I can probably wait until turn four. Stack some armor in the process. Turn we go hear a power play this, then we hear a power play the fires. And uh yeah. Hope it works. Is Abyssal Devs Vandar Demon Hunter a viable deck? Will you try it? I already did, and absolutely not, no. <laughs> it is not viable, but it is fun. Hey welcome, Ogre. So I think I want to play this, hero power, then uh, rotate one of the hammers. I'm gonna be surprised if we pull out the Vandar direct Thar combo even once. Yeah, it's not realistic. But it is possible. <laughs> not this game, though. Okay. The five mana Dr. Boom. Mr. Boom? Nay. He didn't spend four years in medical school for you to call him Mr. Boom. Mr. Boom is his father. He's Dr. Boom. Wait, that's not bad either. Is a doctorate in engineering? He ain't no medical. Doctor? How do you know? Have you seen his uh, resume? Giggity goo, thank you for the 12 months. What is the opponent doing? Waiting until I play minions? Playing their deck uh, properly? I think they're aiming to win the game. Okay, that didn't hit nearly enough cards for me to be happy here. Oh, uh, if only we had drawn that one turn earlier. Then we would have gotten to punish them for holding all those cards. 
Their deck is halved? Yeah, but I just drew them towards the good cards. And they just kill me. So unless I get some serious armor gain soon, it's gonna be tough. Well, hmm. <laughs> just keep talking, Ruffle. Just keep talking. I've also got a decent amount of burst just with this if I trade it uh, one or more times. Why are they worried about that? They don't... Oh, weird that they don't have a dragon bane? Oh, they're just playing around like dirty rats, I guess. That makes sense. Yeah, that has some potential, I suppose. What if we just start smorking from here? Uh, they are just going to kill this and break the weapon, but... Job done. <gasps> More armor? If I can get these on turn 10... Wait, you're not killing this? Why aren't you killing him? Are you are you trying to fatigue yourself? What's your mind? No? Okay. Alright, I think I have to play this. Sets up lethal. And is the most defensive I can be. Yeah, there are a lot of weird cards in the opponent's deck. But if they don't kill the uh the turtle, which is hard to do, even if they clear the board, they lose the game. Should have played the burglary bully to get a coin to copy Kolak. Uh I don't well why not just uh play to win the game, which is what I'm about to do. Or at least working towards. Like, I understood that was a possibility and I even talked about it, but setting up lethal is generally a good thing to do. I mean, at this rate, it's going to be hard to kill me. They only have four cards left. Uh, the problem is the, uh, uh, the mech, the Dragon Bane. But that's already seven mana worth of stuff. I don't think we die here, do we? They don't have a Dragon Bane in their deck. Guess you gotta find a way to make room for Sphere. Shouldn't die here, right? There's no way. Yeah, you're done. No! Do I need two copies of fire to make this deck in this deck to make it consistent? I mean, you don't need it. But it does make the deck more consistent, so I'd recommend it. Keep uh, cannons. We have 
have turned our curse into our strength. Hey! That's the first time we've drawn Vandar. So we can go this on three, this on four? Hey, Ralph, it's my birthday this year. That's impressive. Wait. Next thing you're gonna tell me, you had one last year. Last year was your birthday year. Hey, Ruffle, I don't have Magni for this deck. Can I substitute him for Garrosh? There is no Magni in this deck. Oh, so sure. He's right there. Where? Beside the hero power? This isn't Magni. This is Vandar. So is this. This is a slow draw from the opponent. Wait. They also haven't played the quest line yet. Am I getting baited? Job done. They mean the portrait. I know they mean the portrait. That's still Vandar. What do you want me to like? I, I addressed their point, but it's still Vandar. I don't know how to tell you this other than by telling you repeatedly that it's, it's Vandar. Have I mentioned, however, that it's Vandar? Oh, it's Dead Man's Hand Warrior. Phenomenal. I mean, is it though? Because they're just going to remove my stuff. Alright, no Drek'thar this game, but... We've got 21 three mana cards. That's an early dead man's hand. What? What could they possibly have? Well, that's not quite it. Oh, they're two mana? I don't know how to do math. Bonk. I always thought he reduces by two. And I'm always wrong. Wait, they're running the blacksmithing hammer draw engine too. Play Anaconda and go nuts with the warrior nature spells? I think you're onto something. Moonfang? Wait, that's actually good. Only I could run that card in my deck. Although I think I've got plenty of draw. Also, I just keep getting the fires in the mulligan. So. Alright, let's slow things down a little bit because Brawl is still a card. They also shuffle double armor smith. They're not armor smith skipper with the dead man's hand, so there's still the possibility of skipper bear of. I haven't gotten really high. Okay. Armor made. I haven't gotten really high quality minions yet, have I? Oh, this deck draws fast. Okay. Take no prisoners. He's grafted a uh, a crystal lion onto his left arm now. He learned from uh, Godfrey. No force on Azeroth can stop me. 
or Godric, or Gideon, or whoever it is. Who knows? Bonk. Don't worry, we'll just fatigue him, chat. What's your opinion on the Flood of Curse Warlock decks? Uh, I'm skeptical that there is such a Flood. <laughs> oh god, I needed cards. Grumble? Wait, I could get a 1 mana Crush. Also, wait, doesn't that... That's their last... Cold Light. What's their win condition now? They didn't shuffle Cold Light. Unless I'm misremembering when the first cold light came down, but I thought they tempoed it on three before the dead man's came out. Isn't that cold light like super very good for you? Yeah, for two reasons. One, it drew me cards, which I needed. And for another, like it. I thought is their win condition. <laughs> I think they have one more skipper plus a bear off. At least one more skipper. No on can stop me. Are they just gonna go face a bunch with the unstoppable force? The queen's is Wait, where did that come from? Is that just in their deck? Ogre. This the value, chat. <laughs> Do we just always draw the fires? Is that how this deck works? Not really excited to see a druid, though. I can go here on three and here on four. I think I would rather this be aggro of some sort, but... We have turned our curse into our strength. Let's tempo this. Then play this on three, this on four, and then this might not die though. And that still kind of looks like a damn deck. Ooh, Vandar again. Well, now I want to play this on four. Did you just get fires on two for all of your games so far? Uh, the, yeah, it's been in my mulligan, I think, for every game so far. In one game, in fact, I drew two of them. Wait, maybe it's not the scam deck. I don't think they're running that, right?
Maybe it's like a Kazakus man. Jerkthar keeps showing up late because he don't buy the diamond version. Could be. Must be. It's the only explanation. I guess it's still possible that this is a scam deck, but... Maybe they'll just rip an Ogin summons here. Nope, we're dead. Well, this game was almost fun. Oh! Oh, thank god. Yeah, I'll take that. I mean, it's still, still possible, but it's becoming increasingly less likely that it's the scam deck. Because I don't think you would just throw, yeah, I don't think you would just throw away a lightning bloom like that, would you? Wait, that's burning a card for them. Oh, I don't actually have the, pe the capacity to play this. What did I burn? Innervate? Yeah, I'm, I'm actually growing concerned that it's the, uh... The scamminess. Man. I can really shred. What? I don't want to play into Spreading Plague. Yeah, that was really picked on turn one. Short here. Oblivion awaits. Why aren't you swipe? a way to prevent that nonsense. Well, and we got the fires back. We have turned our curse into our strength. That's actually something. So I want to play this on four. I just need to hope it's not the board. That would be ideal. The 
our deck. Yeah. GG. Job done. <sighs> Doesn't really matter what we do. Other than maybe we can get away with the barricade. Connie can stop the boar, but they just play the darkness. Job done. I understand that. That's why I kept the Okani, but like if the opponent has a brain, it's not going to happen. I mean, they haven't played a switcheroo yet, so I don't need to overreact just yet, I don't think. Got Okani Frozen Buckler as a way to get out of range. And just having a taunt is useful. We could theoretically draw it into more as well. Again, I don't feel like I need to overreact until I see a Witcheroo happen. Wait, that's just in the deck. Could it be Reno? Opium? <laughs> scam Reno Boar Priest? You wouldn't run Boar in Scam deck, but like you would run all of the cards that they played so far in just regular Reno Priest. Fifty armor, it's actually forty-five, but forty-five, but still enough at least for now. Secret is probably very good versus Switcheroo. It could be, depending on what secrets you're running. But like pressure plate, um, explosive, explosive doesn't do it, but pressure plate freezing trap has potential to do so. Misdirection, I guess, but. Doesn't have great overlap with other things that you want to be running. Uh, they would have played a second copy of Hysteria last turn if they had it right and just killed the two of those. I think the opponent's just kind of whiffing on their draw. It's the second Thrive, so we know it's not Reno. They're just not hitting the switcheroo, it seems. I'm just going to play the Okani next turn for minions. Just immediately into that place. No, that's the worst case scenario. Absolutely disgusting. Oh, we got another taunt at least. But I think I have to do this here. Because they can play the switcheroo in the combo on the same turn, otherwise. They might just rip a silence and that would solve the problem. Um, any other outcome? Most other outcomes we had lethal there, I think, right? We just had the five. Five survive. Uh, I mean, I don't think they're going to survive still, though, right? So kind of need to be alive, yes, and not silenced. It's an effect that is on him. It is finished. Yeah, they just didn't have the damage. Good. 
Thank you to legendary patrons Brian Quinn, Charlie Bluearm, Fizzle Jizzix, Gian Rusi, HS Battlefly, Jeffrey Pierce, Justice Crater, Nate Drex, Osiris, Pyroflow Scarlet, St. Arthur, Shadow Yama, Shadow1TV, Vamplord Gaming, and Fanfix. 